Hamlet and Horatio also continued to elbow. As they walked, Hamlet gave his friend further evidence of the king's treachery. when a father's messenger named Oswick brought a request from Claudius summoning Hamlet to duel with Laertes. Sweet Lord, if your lordship were at leisure, I shall impart a thing to you from his majesty. I will receive it. The king has placed a wager that you will prevail in the contest against Laertes. I accept. My service, I recommend. Stay 
in his harsh robe to tell my story. I die, Horatio, for to die shall be king. Tell my story. of this story. They had so many things to remember. And when I, when I asked them if they would take on the challenge of not only, you know, reading fluently the lines, but then, you know, if you practiced enough, you could actually memorize it. They ended up having a lot of work to do. So I'd like to introduce Molly Corso. Stand up, Molly. Molly Corso. Lucas Duncan. together trying to put um, you know everybody in an important role here is uh, it's easy when you have kids who are so eager and excited and, and willing to do anything. So I'm going to continue with our cast. Our Fort and Bra was played by Lucas Duncan. He was the king who came in uh, to take over at the very end. And there would not be the drama in the cemetery without our grave digger and that was Colin Thunder. Messenger Osric, played by Jacob Sigmund. The play within the play had three actors, traveling actors, so if we could have Nairobi, who was a poisoner, stand up. And I love the actor, I love the monster, I love the actor. Uh, we had a couple of pirates and messengers and such, so uh, Reynaldo and Bernardo and Marcellus, played by, uh, we had Gabrielle and Cooper, would you guys please stand? And we, 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 
So I looked at the program last night. Thank you very much for coming in. Great job, Dave. Can have a seat. Phil Hamlet's friends, as we think, uh, Rosencrantz and Guildenstern were played by Chelsea and Jed. Jed. Our spooky ghost of the King Hamlet was played by Maggie O'Donnell with her lower face. And the role of Laertes is played by a shrinking violet, Margaret Massengill. <laughs> Ophelia, poor Ophelia, you were worried about her mom and dad with this. Thank you, Margaret. Thank you, Ophelia. Uh, this next actor brought his A game every single rehearsal in the classroom and went above and beyond with his role as Polonius, and that was Wes Sullivan. Good job, what would Hamlet be without a best friend, played by Madeline Hartigan. This is Horatio. <laughs> oh, and another fine actress that we discovered through this process was our Queen Gertrude, played by Mirabelle Williams. <laughs> And of course, without the most evil character of all in the play, Claudia, so played by Jasper Hawkeye. And I guess that's it. So, oh wait a minute, there was one other person. Yes, our Hamlet this year, played by... Uh, now, Rachel, could you guys stand up one more time? Mr. Hardiman would try to get you on video. Thank you. Guys. So, again, boys and girls, so proud of, of the work that you've done. I hope you have that great feeling inside for uh, a job well done. And uh, we are going to move into the after party in just a minute. I'm going to ask that everybody in the past, you guys, you're going to help bring all of our props and stuff back, wait, just listen, stuff back to the classroom. And then when you get comfortable, you can take off, you know, costumes, have your normal clothes on. We will be waiting for you in the cafeteria with refreshments and drinks, okay? So boys and girls, great job again. Thank you so much.